morning folks Chuck here why not wander <clears throat> in the RV Cooper Jasper Lily Sparky's hiding in his corner just re getting ready to go out for a little morning walk show you where we're boondocking show you some other people boondocking uh, ways of doing it so nice bright sunny morning come on sparks he's not been out yet this morning anyway we're at walmart in sydney nebraska now we've boondocked here before lots of people boondock here lots of times we're kind of surrounded by semis. Sydney is the home of Cabela's. It's right now their store is just the other side of this Motel 6. World Headquarters. We shopped over there a little bit yesterday. But uh, <clears throat> none of these semis were here last night when we came in. They've all come in since. Heard a couple of them running. One of them is smoking a little bit here. But this uh, view. Class C was here. This Class A was not. This uh, fifth wheel over here, one of the things I wanted to show you this morning, they've got their slide out out, but uh, they've got a cord running from a generator in the back of their pickup, but also under that slide they put an orange, uh, they've got a marker out kind of help protect themselves from passing traffic. Lazy Days Class C was over here. Here's our rig with our new kayaks on it. This van was here all night. There was another van I was kind of hoping to catch it, but he got up and left. Uh, I'd seen him put himself to bed yesterday evening. Don't know if this sun's uh, taking things out or not. But they do obviously allow overnight parking here it's uh, western Nebraska about halfway just a little over halfway between North Platte and Nebraska Cheyenne Wyoming there were several other RVs have come and gone but they can see way on the far side they've got regular semi parking slots over there I've boondocked over there, but some of the trucks get so noisy during the night, it keeps you awake. But now that's filling up to the point where they're parking on this side as well. Now it is uh, a 24 hour Walmart. I just saw a person from one of these other RVs walking back from going in the store doing some shopping. We do a lot of Walmart shopping. Everywhere we go, we make sure we go in and get something. Come on, Sparks. He thought we were going back in the RV already, I guess, but see there's several motels in the area. But there's a uh, pull behind trailer over there. Just a little overview. boondocking at Walmart we always try to park against a curb somewhere where there's no way anybody's going to be bothered by that slide out plus we're protected by parking in a spot here like this so gotta head back to the RV get a little breakfast head out make this our morning walk around while we're out trucks get a little road dingy we did drive through a little bit of rain. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and shut the camera off. Check these uh, kayak straps. Boondocking at Walmart, Sydney, Nebraska. If you like our videos, please subscribe, leave a comment, share with a friend. 
anybody you know might be traveling this way and need a place just to sleep overnight it's a great little stop Cabela's Sporting Goods uh, just right over there for the outdoorsman might want to do a little shopping be safe have a great day